the city. A concrete jungle where multitudes of human beings are compressed together in a tight squeeze. A graveyard of the soul where individuality is crushed into a shapeless pulp of anonymity. Parallel solitudes immersed in voice waves ricocheted off the walls of indifference. Garbage trucks hauling away the waste of the enormous stationary beast in a spectacle of crushing sounds and the smell of decay. Overcrowded and treeless rows of tenements housing the large army of the early rising working poor. A conglomerate of materialism, injustice, and intolerance. A massive reservoir of concentrated frustration, sadness, and despair. The city, alive and disturbed, turning and churning, uncomfortable in its own skin, where lives from all corners are merged together, blocks going on and on forever, just like the journey of soul through various dimensions, interactions, and complexities that are the building blocks of every individual. A meeting place of souls, but only if you stroll about with hearts wide open because souls are invisible. A place where, as with dreams, everything imaginable can be dreamed. A seemingly unlikely nursery for reflection, creativity, unity, and community. Urban meditation admits commotion and chaos. The city, something hopeful here, about people being the light and lights coming on and off at all hours like an orchestrated cosmic morse by a species looking for a conduit leading to a higher orbit.